one could be forgiven for thinking this was a state funeral. It was lavish, though. The proceedings started in the early hours of the morning with a private viewing for family and close friends. Later, the procession moved to the Jubilee Community Church close by. Friends, family and clergy paid tribute to Stahi. And despite his checkered past, he was hailed as a man of peace. Stahi's body was also taken to Mannenberg, his stronghold. Here he got a hero's welcome from hundreds of locals who came to pay their last respects. Some years ago, Rasit and his brother were doing driving through the roads, throwing money for the children and the people. And what I know of is some Christmas times and that they always have to issue chicken and fish oil and stuff to people. His daughter, Sadika, said her dad loved the people of Mannenberg and wanted to bring about lasting peace. Growing up, it wasn't easy being his child. Because of the negative stigma and the misunderstanding of his purpose on earth. But I was a proud Sahi, and I'm still a proud Sahi. Sahi was later laid to rest in the Durbanville Memorial Park. Aisha Ismail, Cape Town.